Well, now we are at the booth of Yingli Solar, and next to me is Miss Helena Kimball. She's head of marketing at uh, Yingli Solar Americas. Welcome to Rayry PV TV, and thanks for this interview. Thank you very much for having me. So, what are your or Yingli Solar's expectations for the Solar Power International 2012? We're excited to be here. It's certainly the biggest trade show of the year, and we're announcing some new products. We're also um, happy to meet with our customers that are uh, excited to be here as well. So we're, we've got big expectations that although we're in a time where a lot of people are downsizing and uh, are really focused on where they can have the most innovative products and technologies possible that uh, we're really keeping our, our eyes on the ball and, and uh, paying attention to our customers and the business models. Well, you have mentioned you're here to present a new product. Can you tell us something about that? We're actually standing in front of this new product. Uh, so what we're looking at here is our YGE U series module. And what it is, it's specifically designed for the utility market. And utility markets require uh, systems that can, and modules that can perform at high, high levels. And in addition, they need the voltages that are specific to large scale systems. And this is uh, designed for ground mounted uh, tracking systems. And so we're working with partners like Array Technologies who are the, the leading tracking company for uh, ground-mounted systems like this. And it's certified by UL for 1,000 volts. Is it already available? Yes, it is. Uh, worldwide or only in the United States? In the Americas. Let's talk about the market situation. We know that because of these uh, preliminary tariffs, the worldwide solar market is a little bit insecure. How is this affecting Yingli Solar? We've been uh, aggressively defending ourselves since the inception of this petition, which was uh, October of last year, uh, and the final decisions will be made in November. So from our perspective, we, along with other leading Chinese module manufacturers, are fighting this, and we believe that we're not unfairly dumping, nor are we unfairly subsidized, and we hope that we'll be able to, um, t through government-to-government -government negotiations, be able uh, to come out with something that's reasonable for our customers. And uh, are there any new markets Yingli Solar is trying to enter, like South America or, I don't know, the Middle East? Both those markets, actually. Uh, but in our case, we're uh, out of the, the, our offices in San Francisco, New York, and Sao Paulo. We're specifically focusing on new emerging markets like South America, where right now we're in Brazil, Peru, Chile, and Mexico as well. Well, thank you very much. It's uh, Miss Helena Kimball, Head of Marketing, Yingli Solar Americas.